to Midnight Rabbi Inspires during Cholomayad Pesach. Zman Cheroseinu. Got the song from Nisim. Time of freedom. Walking um, through the streets of Beit. I just came back from Yushalayim. Here at Kodesh. It was by my Rebbe. And I got to see some good friends there. Catch up. Kids had a good time now. My way to a nice class. Also have to learn something. And Mincha, you know what Mincha means? It's the afternoon prayers, Mincha. And we're walking through this park, beautiful park, on my way there. And I just want to share a few ideas to, right now. You can feel it in the air. The nice blue skies of Eretz Swells. When I first came to Eretz Swell, it's always so inspirational and beautiful. I'm walking through the hills of the Yehuda. Beautiful, beautiful place. And if we get inspired by the beauty around us, let's just have a quick look. Wow, look at this. Beautiful. Ah, Take it in. Wonderful hills. The building all the time around here. Up and up. So we're holding right now in the first day of Cholomoyed. For us, Eretz Yisrael, Nikas, people that live here, I know some people are still in Yom Tov, some people uh, should be in Yom Tov. And we are enjoying the light of Pesach, the first day of the Surya Sa'omer. Today is a special day at Sudis Esther, a special meal of Esther, that Esther was successful to defeat Homan. And the whole story from Purim came out today with her special meal. She was able to bring him down with positivity, Focusing on that Nikudas Tova, the Suda, the spark of godliness within. This was what Haman knew himself was going to bring him down. The little Svir Saoma, the little heat, the, like we say, like this, you can see, yeah, like that amount of flour was going to, no, sorry, like that, was going to bring him down. And that is the idea of, of the Jewish soul in this exile. For Mashiach comes as so much craziness going on but inside all we need is that little bit of good we take that out and we see the good revealed so this esther's that kind of day it's the surah saoma first day and that's what defeated Haman by us cleaving to the laws of the base of mingdish our traditions our hope that we'll be back in the base of mingdish our hope that we have a godly soul and it will never be distinguished or extinguished sorry it will be distinguished won't be extinguished that power gives us the ability to get out of this exile. And that's the idea of Zer Eina Shovali that Homan said, Shem Avaya, backwards, the name of God, the wrong way around. We turn it back around to Shem Hashem. Yisbuchu HaShemayim V'sagel Aretz. You can see the hills. The whole world is rejoicing. And that's a powerful, powerful way of being. That we can always draw it into that place of goodness and godliness. And that will give us the strength to overcome everything. And should be Zoha, please God, we should be blessed. With a beautiful Chag of Pesach, as man of Chesed, time of love and kindness. To be kind, it's not easy. Children need so much nowadays time, physical things, attention. At the same time, we've also got to be real ourselves as parents to take care of what we need. And that's part of us. I was listening to Beautiful and looking at of Kuruga. He said a beautiful idea for mothers. You know, everyone wants to be good parents nowadays. Thank God. We're learning classes and trying to improve ourselves. Uh, back in the day, it seemed to just come from a certain common sense understanding. Now we sort of need to re-educate ourselves. We gather to the Bincha this whole week of Pesach. Time to really develop, work, focus on our children. Not just the night of Seder, but the whole week. And that's with kindness. Kindness is the key to everything. And it's also kindness to ourselves as, as a mother and father, make sure we're taking care of ourselves. That's why I'm going to a Shia now uh, class. I also need to learn and grow. I can have energy to give back to my children. And that's part of the balance. You know, we go out into the fields and speak to Hashem, go out and speak to the ones of this world. And if we get inspired by it. And all the miracles that are going on all the time to keep us alive and holy, learn, live here. Today I even have to work. I know it's Chol Hamoed. 
the whole part, I have to go work. But that's different devotion, different clothings of Hashem's spiritual light. In previous years, I never had to work. So this year, this is my avoda, what I have to do to be happy with that choice and to go ahead. That's always the, the key. Keep going ahead and to see that with whatever we're given in front of us to allow Hashem to run the Seder like He did this Seder night. A beautiful, beautiful, inspirational night. And the main thing I, I focus on is that part that gave us such success with Esther, Sudas Esther today, is that the Jewish people are always growing no matter what. They try to destroy us in the Holocaust and we keep growing as a nation. We keep growing as people, as individuals, as fathers, as mothers, as friends, as husbands and wives and dedicated people to grow. And that growth gives us the ability to always develop and feel that inner simcha that will give us the inner joy to overcome everything. We're going to talk about different ideas in terms of what we should build with other people, you know, and, and, and more clever ways of developing our schedule and our goals in life, our mission statement. We've got lots of ideas to talk about over the Sphere of Omer, over these seven weeks leading up to Shavuos. That little bit of flower, that little bit of of Svirat uh, Korban Omer, Svartem Lechem, which is speaking it, you know, Tanu Peh, says Tanufa, to use our mouth to speak Pesach, with all these ideas of using the mouth to speak of holiness. And we should be blessed that because we're dedicated to this special mission, we should only have blessings. The Birchus Maradecha, there's a special blessing of, the, of this time of meeting, a meeting with Hashem every day in even more intimate ways than normal. And we should enjoy it. Enjoy the family time, enjoy the time, special time we're in. And we should be able to dance this year with the Korban Pesach, Shri Shal Pesach, singing Az Yosha Moshe Vene Yisrael Sashira Azos. We should sing that song of Mashiach together. Amen.